Hi everyone and welcome to Darksiders 2 Definitive Edition Definitive Difficulty Walkthrough This is part 22, Lost Light And we have finally uh, got out of the Kingdom of the Dead And we have changed the scenery a little bit I'm gonna show you uh, some parts of it Like what I'm showing you here And then we are going to cut out uh, And we're going to go immediately towards the fighting and the puzzles. This is a short video uh, comparing it to every uh, every other video that I publish. This is ra a rather epic walkthrough already because I'm not sure but this is going to be really really like close to 30 episodes like I'm already calling it close to 30 episodes. Really long walkthrough. One of the longest walkthroughs that I've done outside maybe a Brutal Trilogy maybe I mean, comparing all three games. Yeah, that, that was that was pretty pretty big. And I guess uh, maybe the order. Editing the order was fucking hell on earth, by the way, guys. If you just want to know, because the game is almost all, all almost all the game is walking around and having long cutscenes, which is fine, but. It's fucking hell to edit. So, yeah, this is the first fight of Lost Light. It's a bunch of uh, corrupted angels, which actually have like some sort of uh, pistols on their weapons, and they hit pretty hard. By the way, the enemies are going to step up the, dif the difficulty really, really high from this point onwards. Like I'm, I'm closing level 20. If I'm not level 20 already in this video. And it feels like the enemies are really, really hitting me really hard. I mean, I, I watched walkthroughs on Apocalyptic, and I played on Apocalyptic, and I don't remember the hit, the enemies uh, stepping up the challenge so uh, high in this part. So that's the only cutscene I leave because otherwise you won't get the context of this fighting. Uh, from this point onwards, this guy is going to fight with us and this becomes a rather timed battle you just have to survive for, for a couple of uh, minutes or rather seconds i guess or minutes we, we could say minutes two or three minutes and uh, the battle is going to end i'm still using the gangster axe uh, but i'm going to be uh, upgrading and using the mace maximus which i'm going to put a little cute name on it as well uh, oh my god did you see that combo it almost killed me jesus so and these are not even the harder enemies of this uh, the couple of levels that are coming up and after lost light we're going to have a really interesting part where we're going to be traveling to earth and uh, earth is it's almost like an endurance test. It's not really that fun. We're going to have a new kind of mechanic. Uh, it's not. It's not gonna be uh, fighting like this. Uh, I just don't want to spoil it if you're seeing this for fun. So I'll just see it in the next episode. Uh, and wait, are we actually going to Earth in the next episode? Yeah, I think we are. Actually, let me check it. Actually, I know this is really crappy to do, but. Yeah, we're definitely going to Earth in the next episode. Sorry, guys. So, yeah, Earth is interesting. It's it's, in, it's interesting because it's a big change of pace. Uh, but I don't really like it. Like, like it's not. It shouldn't. Earth should have been more like levels like this, and maybe more fighting, and normal combat mechanics, and not really the. Uh, what, what it's going to be? I don't want to spoil it. I just don't. And, uh, but uh, nevertheless, it's a it's a cool change of pace. I don't really hate it. I, d I don't actually hate it. I just don't like it uh, that much. And there's going to be a couple of bosses uh, showing their fighting prowess uh, uh, during these uh, last chapters of the game. And. They're going to be really tough, actually. Especially Samael. I'm already calling it, like, from from this place onwards. Samael 
on definitive is going to be a pain in the fucking ass because Samael on Apocalyptic can already two or three shot you if you if you don't get the combat mechanics really really well and he has like an annoying faces really annoying faces like Samael is harder than the final boss on this game and I re I'm, I'm, I'm already seeing it like when normal enemies can combo me to death or kill me in two hits like some uh, later enemies that you're going to see Samael is going to one shot me probably with every single fucking thing or, or two shot me at the most uh, yeah, because this is kind of like a character, like, like the character that I wanted to make. This is kind of like the uh, glass cannon character. I hit really, really hard, especially with the Mace Maximus. I'm gonna hit really, really fucking hard. And and the criticals are, are like close to 50% on each of these weapons. So I'm, I'm hitting a lot of criticals, which is... If you're gonna choose between uh, direct hit damage, as I always said, guys, if you're gonna choose between lower damage, let me explain it like this. If you're gonna choose between lower damage and high critical chance and damage, choose that one. Don't choose uh, lower critical chance and lower critical damage and high, uh, like, direct hit damage, like normal hit choose criticals always choose fucking criticals if you're going for a dps so yeah i guess we are done almost this is the portal to earth and in the next chapter we're going to see earth and once again for me because i play dark side as one and it's going to be a really nostalgic trip for people who played dark side as one so i'll see you there guys thank you for watching and take care